same alternator but it's on my wind turbines self exciting I've got a bunch of magnets in the rotor this isn't how my wind turbines are though this one's made for indoor use these are just some small windings for higher voltages when it's running this is also just a single phase machine. Here's the two outputs and there's a center top for the center of the coils. So there's, if I remember right, there's 12. I know there's 14 coils in these Delcos. Seven on one side and seven on the other. So here's seven coils and here's seven coils. The headlight is hooked up to one, one half, or no, this is one of the center taps, the longer one, these are the short ones, this is 14 coils here, this is a bridge rectifier, these are the field coil windings, the purple wires, you can see the positive comes up here to this salt water resistor I have here. It's just a resistor. If I connect the two together, it puts all the power to the field coil windings. Just a way to control the, the current. Here's the negative. From the bridge rectifier going to the field coils. Here's the positive going to the spoon. I got a razor blade for the other one. The other electrode. This is just a shitty bridge rectifier put together quickly. Some of the wires for the high voltage windings are not being used. Not right now. Well, just so you can see, there's no cogging at all. It spins like crazy. Very easy to spin. Self exciting. This is hooked up to 14 of the coils, the, the high voltage out. It excites at about 300 RPMs, it starts to generate power. Hard for me to hold this in. It's a 75 watt light. a special rotor in it. The field 
The armature is wired in a special way too to give the single phase. I'll take one of these apart in a later video. Plus I'll have more with this machine does. That'll be a different video. Some interesting stuff you'll see here.